When I subtract light, I usually add it back, but from a direction that I want it to come from. If we push the subject back far enough under a tree, near the back of it, we can sometimes find an accent light to go around the subject. So my procedure is basically to either find a place with flat light, or make it flat, then add the main light. The El Gobo is a very useful tool, but I usually use it in conjunction with a reflector or a softbox flash to kick back more light to the face, and also to keep the background exposure about the same as it was without the El Gobo. The problem here is that there's lots of light above her, but that row of trees blocks main light from reaching her face. From this other direction, it's a little easier to see the placement of the El Gobo. No light modifiers used here. Note the bright nose and dark eyes. The reflector filled in the eyes, but because we haven't done anything about the bright light above her, her nose is still too bright. And finally, adding the El Gobo took care of the nose problem, with the reflector doing the rest. One more look at the before and after. When you're trying to separate yourself from your competition, the importance of light control cannot be overstated. It can take a weak image and turn it into a much stronger image. You are in control. This will be the final setup with our gobo and reflector in place. This was a typical, very overcast sky. To our eyes, he looked just fine. But not when we capture it. Too much top light and light from our left side. Blocking light from the wrong direction takes care of most of the problem. Then kicking light back in with my fuzzy flector introduced the necessary frontal lighting. While it's usually better to light someone from slightly above the face with a softbox, sometimes a ground-based reflector is just more fun, and of course with a reflector you can see what you're going to get, and there's no recycling time. Obviously this is very unflattering lighting, and not something she's going to like. Adding and subtracting made a world of difference from the previous image, didn't it?